WON YouTube Networks is now on Facebook. Check it out. There's only one man who delivered astronomical numbers all in the postseason, the 2010 postseason. And that man was Big Pops himself, Willie Stargell, the hero of the 2010 World Series, posting up a 536 average with 12 home runs and 25 RBIs all in one postseason. Willie Stargell, the commanding presence of a team leader, of a winner. Sox Baseball, catch it on WOA. Watch out, they're coming. There's no time to lose. It's time to bounce around and spin around. No time to hide. It's time to come out and watch the Looney Animals. Check it out only on UPN 5. Welcome to the world of stupid. Forget about schooling children. It's time to school stupid humans. Class is in session with Boneheads 101. Check it out on 5. Put on your socks next week for the most anticipated homestand of the year. It's the first homestand of the season. Catch all the action and your first look at the Power Pack 2015 New York Sox as they take on their division rivals, Minnesota. Sox versus Twins, Friday at 4 and Saturday at 1 on UPN 5. Preview show for 2015. This is yours truly, John Thoreau. It is my pleasure to present to you our sixth consecutive season of New York White Sox baseball on WON YouTube. We are here outside the ballpark of Grant Street campus, and let me tell you, this is a place of home of high school champions. When it comes to the New York White Sox, they have won five consecutive world championships powered by MLB the show. This year, Sock Baseball will be powered and brought to you by MLB 15 The Show via PS3. Now last year's club of course was loaded with all-star talent, but this year is totally different. Why? Because for the first time in five seasons, MLB The Show will be bringing you legends and Hall of Famers. So without further ado, let's take a look at some of the players and legends and Hall of Famers that will be making the roster for the New York Sox and that you'll be seeing on WON this season. The two big name legends who will be wearing the White Sox uniform is George Brett and Dave Winfield. George Brett in his outstanding career hit a total of 317 home runs and drove in 1,596 RBIs. Throughout the season he'll be platooning as a DH who will most likely be playing third base almost every day of the week along with of course his partner Miguel Cabrera who we'll talk about later on in the broadcast. Another big legendary name that will be wearing the White Sox uniform will be Dave Winfield who will also play DH and will also be manning the outfield. In his outstanding career he has 465 home runs and drove in 1,833 runs. This is not his first go around being in a White Sox uniform. In Major League Baseball 10 he was part of the 2010 and 2011 White Sox Championship Club. Among the next legends, of course, part of Winfield and Brett will be Edgar Martinez, Tom Seaver, Nolan Ryan, Phil Necro, and Dennis Eckersley. We'll be touching on the pitching staff when it comes to Seaver, Ryan, and Necro later on, along with Dennis Eckersley. Now, there's more to life than Hall of Famers. There's more to life than seeing All-Stars. There's new faces when it comes to New York White Sox, and that's what is compiled this next couple of clips that you'll be seeing in spring training. New center fielder, new first baseman, rookie of the year, all the X's and O's of the new faces that will be making the Sox roster this year. Here's what they did in the spring, and here is the team's teammates, actually, that you'll be seeing that are new that will be joining the White Sox organization this year. 
The 2015 New York White Sox is loaded with big names. One of the biggest one is taking over for another big name. Prince Fielder, the new second baseman for the New York White Sox. Last year was a terrible year for the big man with only three home runs and 16 runs batted in. The 2014 season for Fielder was plagued with injuries and ended up having a season-ending neck surgery to prepare a misaligned disc in his neck. He hopes to rebound with a new club and try to bring the Sox their sixth consecutive championship. Another big name and a surprising trade that happened during the offseason is Miguel Cabrera. Last season he had 25 home runs and 109 runs batted and he drove in. He'll be manning third base mostly for the New York White Sox as well as playing the DH throughout the season. Miguel Cabrera ranked one of the best players in Major League Baseball and an outstanding out defensive player as well. Another couple of names to look at is Jose Abreu, who won the Rookie of the Year of the New York White Sox. He was not part of last year's MLB The Show roster. And another big name that will come will be Adam Eaton. Last year, in his first season as a New York White Sox, although you didn't see him in Major League Baseball uh, 14 or 13, he had one home run and 35 runs batted in. His season ended prematurely due to injuries to his back. Other new faces to watch? Victor Martinez and another go around with the White Sox, Edwin Encarnacion and Adam LaRoche. You know, we talk about Hall of Famers, we talk about sluggers, we talk about defense. But what makes a baseball team win? That's pitching. And not only is the pitching rotation for the Sox loaded with all-stars, it's also loaded with legends. Here are some of the legends and all-star pitchers starting and relieving that will be on the Sox roster this year comes to the pitching staff of the New York White Sox, they are armed and ready and locked and loaded. Mixed with young arms, future Hall of Famers, and legends, this Sox talent of pitchers is proved to be probably one of the best ones assembled. With Tom Seaver, Necro, Ryan, manning the 1-2-3 spot, Jeff Samarja, Robertson, Chris Sale, Sabathia, and Dennis Eckersley will anchor this rotation from top to bottom, from the starting five, to middle relief and to the closing position. By far, Major League Baseball ranks the sock rotation the best in baseball. that's going to be joining the Sox roster in this 2015 season. But how do we get to five consecutive championships? In fact, let me make it simpler. How do we make it to the 2014 season with another championship? Well, let's take a look back at the 2014 season and the fifth consecutive championship season for the New York White Sox.
Well, you just saw what occurred in 2014. We've also showed you some of the new faces that will be in new places, wearing this uniform that I'm wearing. And yes, this is what they'll be wearing again for the third consecutive season. What will become of the 2015 New York White Sox? Will they capture their sixth consecutive championship? That's yet to be determined, and we'll have to wait and see. The season begins Monday at Kansas City, but our coverage begins on Friday, April 10th, as the New York White Sox open up a three-game series against the Minnesota Twins. It's our season opener, and it's the home opener. So we hope you join us for the 52-game schedule here on WON. And until Friday, for all of us here at WON Sports, this is yours truly, John Fields. Hope to see you in the broadcast booth, and I hope your game is a good game. So long, everybody.